Yo, what up my K-popers? I am Hanika de Los Angeles and this is K-pop Rewind. So this is what I do here. I take old school K-pop music video and I analyze them and try to figure out what made K-pop so great back then. Because nowadays K-pop is not Wow, fantastic baby. Nope. So today we are going to be trying something a little bit different. Because today we're doing a title battle. Big Bang and Seven. So you guys already know who Big Bang is. And if not... So, let's talk about Seven. He used to be a YG solo artist back in the days before Big Bang even debuted. And he's also been in a couple of Korean dramas and Korean drama. Scandal. So, why them? So you see, Big Bang and Seven have a song called La La La. La La La. But la La La. Both songs were released the same year, the same month. Literally days apart. Even GD prank call Seven. Oh, so let's get started. Are those bandage straws? Or an old school dildo? Just saying. Imagine those being actual dildos and just holding it up to him. <laughs> Fuck. No. Bitch, those no longer exist because they kill the environment and turtles and shit. It's amazing to see how far we have come into civilization in a 10 year span of a time. She is destroyed because people find out that she is dating the great seven. The scandal is everywhere. The paparazzi are invading her private life. Ho oh, ho, sweetheart. If you knew that in 10 years, nobody's going to give a shit. Idols dating life is not as scandalous as it used to be back then. Because nowadays, we have much bigger scandals. Technology at its finest. Back in the days, we had to tap the same button until the letter that we wanted appeared. Those were the struggle back in the days, kids. But nowadays, nobody has time to be typing like that. Nobody is typing nowadays, period. We just send voice messages to each other. It's too much work. We are starting that transition to become the useless people from Wally. -E. A pink razor! Hello, Moto. Back in the days when I was in high school, the razor was the shit. It was like the iPhone before the iPhone. Literally before the iPhone. Everyone back in high school had one. Except for me, that I have one of those prepaid phones that you have to buy like a little card on Walgreens and then add minutes. I was that of a broke ass. But actually, kind to think about it, I'm still a broke ass. So... Nothing has really changed in the span of 10 years. Yeah. 
Oh God, look at this girl. She is so mentally conflicted and trapped. And then look at him. He is like not bothered. He is shaving and exfoliating. So after that long ass trip in the bus, she has realized she is dating one of the biggest, hottest pop stars in Korea. And so she shows up to the events like haters gonna hate. She realized that life is not that bad after all. We're getting spicy over here. They are about to have sex in a limousine. Yes. Yes, honey. That's how you know that you have made it in life. Because you plus a hot idol plus sex plus a limousine equals bliss. <laughs> Bitch, the driver know what's up. The driver knows what is about to get down in the back of the limousine. Okay, so next up we have Big Bang. So let's start. You're the what? Uh, 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 I like the, reals. the shit? We, 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 we like the reals. I hope you don't mean the actual poop. It's fascinating how shit can mean like the greatest thing ever and also the baddest thing ever. Reals. Me and my cook and all the books with the reals. That is me throughout whole high school. Because you know what? Fuck high school. Their fashion choices will never cease to amaze me. I just can't. Bros, it has been two years since you debuted. Why are you still dressing the same? You haven't changed shit, but you established that you are the shit. Confusing. One thing will always remain timeless is that GD looks so damn cute. That's the future father of my children. What do you say, GD? You, me, a limousine, a creepy driver, big bang happening in my pants, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Rejoice, tabby fans across the world. So you have no idea why this scene is a big deal for us? It's because T.O.P. is notoriously known as the K-pop idol that does not want to take his shirt off. But this scene is important because this is the first time we had a glimpse of the Forbidden Kingdom. He had to take off his shirt for a role that he was playing on a film. And you know what? We were not disappointed. Mm. Taeyeon, Taeyeon, and his iconic, crazy hairstyles. Even worse than GD. Those braids, Poppy. I mean. And this is a segment I like to call Death Song's Obsession with Butts. It makes no sense. Everybody get him by. Everybody get him by. Who made this mess? Who allowed for this kind of mess to be done? Who is going to clean that up? Not me, bitch. Not me. Can somebody explain?
explain to me why they are studying in probably the most stylish classroom I have ever seen in my life and yet they have a television that is straight from the 60s also can someone tell me what channel is this a TV channel that only plays big fan footage has all my undivided attention imagine what kind of programming they must have in that channel so coming up we have Taehyung's abs compilation and after that shows of GD's fashion style and later what not to wear stay tuned After watching two music videos with the exact same title, I still don't know what La 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 means. So if I have to pick a winner based on the music videos, I will pick Seven. Just because I want to be that bitch in real life. But in terms of music, I pick Big Bang because the song is catchy as hell. So uh, it's a tie? I really don't like ties. Everybody's a winner. No, that's not how life works. You either win or you lose. So you know what? Just because we get to see T.O.P's amazing app, I say the Big Bang wins. Nothing to do with the quality of production, to do with the artistry. Oh, no, just because of the apps. This is a thirsty ass girls channel. If you want something like more in deep, an understanding of an appreciation of music wrong channel and that my boys and girls is what will make k-pop great give me k-pop great again <clears throat> go check out my other k-pop rewind videos my personal favorite is the jyp one also check out my guide on how to survive when your bias is on military service because if you don't i will send a creepy limo driver to stalk you so subscribe like and i'll see you next time okay love you bye